Hello, my name is Adrian Goldberg and welcome to my latest minute review, The Miseducation of Cameron Post. Now, some films make you laugh, some make you cry, a few, let's face it, send you to sleep. But this one, a Sundance Grand Jury winner, no less, made me angry more than anything else. It is the simple story of a teenage lesbian played with vulnerable, baffled intensity by Chloe Grace Moretz, the one prom night is found romping in the back of a car with another girl, after which her foster parents send her off to a gay conversion therapy centre run by evangelical Christians. The movie is fiercely political, but to its credit, it makes its point through personalities rather than through polemic, as Moretz's character, the Cameron Post of the title, navigates her way through the different personalities at the camp. Even the Christian pastor who tries to turn her straight, the Reverend Rick, played by John Gallagher Jr., is given a sympathetic hearing here by director Desiree Akavan. But there's no question about where the sympathies of this beautifully shot film lie with the confused youngsters whose lives are turned upside down by the most unchristian type of Christianity. The UK government has promised to ban gay conversion therapy. In the United States, it's still legal in many states, mostly the kind of heartland areas that returned Donald Trump to the White House. You can draw your own conclusions.